solve cos theta equals negative 1 over 2, where theta is between 0 and 2 pi, non-graphically using the cos inverse feature of a calculator. Get theta by itself by taking the inverse cosine of both sides. The result is 120 degrees. Cos theta is negative in quadrants 2 and 3. Use symmetry to draw the angle in quadrant 3. The second angle is 240 degrees. The solution over the domain where theta is between 0 degrees and 360 degrees is 120 degrees and 240 degrees. Or, using radians, 2 pi over 3 and 4 pi over 3. In part b, solve cos theta equals negative 1 over 2 non-graphically using the unit circle. Bring up the unit circle. We are trying to find the angles with an x-coordinate of negative 1 over 2. The solution is 2 pi over 3 and 4 pi over 3. This is the same result we found in part A. In part C, solve cos theta equals negative 1 over 2 graphically using the points of intersection. Draw the graph of y equals cos theta. Draw y equals negative 1 over 2. Place dots at the points of intersection. The solution is 2 pi over 3 and 4 pi over 3. This is the same result we obtained in parts A and B. In part D, solve cos theta equals negative 1 over 2 graphically using theta intercepts. We need to rearrange the equation so it equals 0. Multiply both sides of the equation by 2. Bring all terms to the left side so the equation equals 0. Draw the graph and place dots at the theta intercepts. The solution is 2 pi over 3 and 4 pi over 3. This is the same result we obtained in parts A, B, and C.